We're here at AES on the Gibson Pro Audio booth with Skipper Wise, who's founder of the Neat Company. And this is one of those shows where a lot of the stuff is very expensive and aimed at audio professionals. But here's a little bit of something for someone who's maybe at a, a more entry level in the in the game, you know. Uh, and they're colourful too. I mean, what, what's the deal here? I've well, never seen microphones like these. Well, Paul, these are widgets A, B, and C. And the beauty of this is that that means since there's 26 letters in the alphabet, I have 23 more microphones to design and build. Yeah. <laughs> but widgets are plug and play. It's a $99 microphone, 24-bit 96, and it's has a fidelity that you normally don't hear at USB microphones at this price point. One of the beauties of the design is the large cavity. And the large cavity allow us to create a pop filter that's in internally designed. These are layers of mesh that you look at all three models. And that way we don't have to put anything over the capsule inside, so the capsule's acting accurately. So there's an incredible bottom end out of these microphones, and they really handle SPL well if you want to get up front to them. But think about this today. People are doing Skype, they have quick ideas or they want to bring up their DAW and record something. This is just, at $99, goes on your desk, it's fun. Um, widget um, A over here, I always think of the 60s because it's kind of got that Apollo space capsule kind of look. Widget B over here, I, or B, B's over here, excuse me. Um, this is sort of like the Buck Rogers period of time, so I always think of it as the 1930s. And then widget C is kind of like the 1950s. So it's just three different unique looks. All the mics sonically sound identical. You also have on the back of each microphone the ability to be able to turn this and move the capsule up and down its ladder so you can position it. So if it's on your desk, let's say you're doing a vocal or you want to do an acoustic guitar, just drag down the element to the position that you need, um, which is kind of fun. Um, offers a wonderful, inexpensive way to get into good audio. And you have put uh, a back electric capsule in there, I think, is that yeah, correct? This is a 12-millimeter uh, capsule, mm. uh, though it sounds a little bit l bigger than a normal 12-millimeter. It'll sound something similar to what you hear in a 14-millimeter. Yeah. I look forward to trying those. I mean, it's a k kind of fun alternative, isn't it? Yeah. Well, the idea is, is, is fun. I mean, look, if you think about the Atlantic Ocean of, of people today recording, I mean, it may be somebody doing something serious with a song, somebody having a business conversation on a, on a, uh, a VoIP call, let's say, like Skype. Or it may be somebody recording their cat and getting a million hits every 10 minutes and making a lot of money on YouTube. But the bottom line is you want to be ready to record. So the idea that you can pick this thing up, plug it right into your computer, bring up your DAW such as GarageBand or Cakewalk, and bingo, there you go. And all $99? All $99. So when are we uh, expecting to see these in the stores? They're in the stores. Okay, so when can you get one into uh, the UK for us to play with? Well, I believe that's already happening as we speak. So hopefully by the time this video is out and you and I and our public are seeing what's going on in the world, you'll be able to buy these at their local retail store. Yeah, thanks very much. Thanks, Paul.